What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Days Gone. I think we're like five episodes away from the end. I, I'm not too sure, but it does feel like we're pretty close to the end. This game has been so story heavy that I, I, I'm honestly surprised, and I'm super, super happy it's turned out to be this way. But we're very close to the end. On the last episode, uh, we did a couple more errands with Sarah. We, we got some more equipment. Um, we tried out finally the napalm cocktail, and um, we took out an entire horde, our first horde, which was really, really intense. Took a long time. And then we thought that Sarah had the cure to the freaks. We, try, we tried out the cure, and it, it just didn't work. And then now Sarah, for some reason, she's been transported from her tent into an underground facility. And it, I get the vibes that she's being held captive there by this camp. I, I, I don't know what's going on, but her and, her and Deke are at the point where... They're ready to go AWOL and leave this camp behind. Corporal like, Saint. Hey, D. As soon as they find it here. For you. But I, I, an East Coast city boy doing all the way the hell out here? Actually, yeah. Uh, served with a guy from Long Island. Accent's kind of hard to miss. No shit, right? Let me tell you, man. Before shit went down, I used to run this website called You Need Guns? I Got Guns.com. Oh. oh, Jesus. Holy shit. That's where I've seen you before. You had a. You had a cable show. Uh, my Chicago, old man used Chicago to watch Chopper. It back in the day. Hey, your old man had good taste. Goddamn right I did. I used to travel the country hitting up out of the way gun shows, flea markets, shit like that. I, I guess this is about as out of the way as it gets. I guess it isn't yes. like that, huh? Yes. Boys, it's gonna be lit. It's gonna be lit. It's gonna be extra lit. Okay, good and stealth situations, versatile, blah, blah, blah. Oh, come on, man. So, you guys told me to get the, hey, Chica the, the Chicago, the Chicago, the Chicago, Chicago chopper. The Chicago, Chicago. Why can't I say that word right now? Chicago chopper. And, um, we got it. It's the best gun in the game. Um, uh, for some reason, I want to, uh, I want to suit up my bike as well. But the hey, mechanic dude. just doesn't uh, let me. Like, corporal. I don't know why he does not let me freaking. Hey, I'm just going to repair my fuel and see if he lets yeah, me after. I can fix that. No, he still Whatever doesn't let me. For. He's a freaking scumbag. You got it. Corporal so, John. anyways, we around. now have the Tommy gun, which is the best gun in the game, and it's gonna be lit. It's gonna be fun. I'm excited. Okay, I'm gonna stop talking. So we're gonna go here, and we're gonna go to this mission, which is uh, actually we have two missions here. That's odd. Should we take our bike? All right, let's see. I'm pretty sure we can take our bike here. I don't know. Can we take our bike? Isn't this like... God damn it! No, we cannot take our bike in there. I'm gonna go here and see if it's inside here. Maybe it's through here. Okay, there it is. Uh, sir, I was... You know when I was young? We used to explore caves like these. Looking for petroglyphs, carvings by the Modoc, other tribes. Thousands of years old. You know, they never lived in these caves, the heathens. In the cold and the dark. But look at us. Look how far we have fallen. Uh, Colonel, Colonel, I, I was... The soldier who used to be assigned to Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver, the soldier you replaced, has gone AWOL. He broke into my private chambers and took my personal copy of the Holy Bible. I want it returned. Yes, sir. I've marked his last known location on your map. Dismiss, Corporal. All oh, this for a frickin'... This guy... is getting on my last fucking nerve. Well, that was an easy, easy mission, I guess, I suppose. So, I've got a plan. Obtain five samples of water, hemlock. I think that's for Sarah, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, that is for Sarah. All right, so now we go outside. Yeah, that's for Sarah. That's the next mission for Sarah. I'm guessing this is through here. All right, here we go. I'm excited to use my new weapon, man. I'm, I'm going to be honest. Very excited. I want to change my freaking bike, but I just, just they're not letting me. For some reason, I don't know. I guess we're gonna have to do this during the night time because it looks like it's gonna. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be a pain in the butt. This is gonna suck. 
A short while ago, I stood here before you and grieved for the loss of Captain Menes, our only doctor and my very dear friend. And for what great purpose did Captain Jimenez perish? So that a drug addict, a worthless excuse of a human being, could get high. Jimenez died because he stood between a junkie and a bag full of narcotics. Yeah. 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 Oops. I have taken steps to see that this never happens again. For their own safety, I have moved Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver into the Ark, where they will be under protective watch 24 hours a day. That's why they moved them. The call is going out. Any person who has highly trained knowledge and skills, skills that cannot be replaced, Mechanics, engineers, scientists, medical personnel are to be taken from active duty and removed to the Ark until this war is over. From now on, no one is allowed entrance into the Ark unless they are on special assignment and unless they are personally vetted by myself. There will be no exceptions. I am beginning to see, I'm afraid. That our enemy has never been the freaks. They know not what they do. Mankind, in all his state of degradation and transgression, is our true enemy. Keep a watchful eye on your neighbors. Evil surrounds us. Company dismissed. All right. Freaking pointless. Well, not really, because now we know why Sarah's down there. You know? All right. There we go. Now we know why Sarah was moved. Oh, by the way, a lot of you have been telling me to put some skill points, so I got three skill points. And I think one of them allows me to have more bullets. I think it's this one up in the increased ammo capacity for all ranged weapons hell yeah hell yeah two birds one bullet increases pressure for different ranged weapons yes i'll do this one all right all right guys so now we're gonna go and obtain some um some water hemlock for sarah should be interesting. I want to upgrade my bike already because I'm eligible, but for some reason the mechanic doesn't let me. It's kind of strange. I don't know what the hell that's all about. But yeah, I think that that perk that we just bought, that skill, I don't know if it allows us to carry more ammo or, or weapons to carry more ammo. I'll check now, but I'm kind of curious. I wonder why it's always so freaking slow. By the way, look at my Tommy gun, how beautiful it looks. It just looks the Chicago. Chicago, Chicago chopper. Not Chicago, Chicago. Ch whatever. Fuck it. I didn't even know I could have said that word. What the hell is that? I used to be able to say that word. O'Brien. Oh, Come in, O'Brien. I know Brian is shit. Turned it off. Look, I need your help. I'm listening. My wife, the woman you helped me track down. I remember. Founder O'Brien. She's alive. That's incredible. The odds of her making it out. No, look, I don't have time. Look, I found her. She's alive. She's being held by uh, the militia. The guys that you told me about. I'm sorry. 
Look, I don't need your goddamn sympathy. I need your help. She's being held in a place I can't get to her. I need you to help me to break her out. You know I can't do that. Wait a second. Okay, but there's something wrong. Wow, that just cost my freaking dialogue there. Okay, but there's something you have to do for us first. Name it. I will do anything. Keep your radio on this time. I'll be in touch. Okay, O'Brien. O'Brien! Damn it. Well, I guess that's worth it. Huh. Now we get to freaking... Hopefully get some help from these freaking assholes. Yes, sir. Corporal, good, yes. Another traitor was discovered in our midst. A spy working for the anarchists. Anarchists, I guess. Yes, you remember. He escaped before he could be apprehended. He was chased north, but our patrol lost him. I marked the position he was last seen on your map. We need him alive, Corporal. To find out what he was doing here, how much he knows, and what his crew wants. Yes, sir. I'll do my best. As do we all. As do we all. Dismissed. I hate this guy, man. Renegade camp. Sons of bitches. You think you can ambush me and get away with it? Thank God. We're right here. I'm looking for a damn ambulance. Need some help. I need some freaking help for sure. Thank you. I need this. Yes, we do. This Deep. is Ricky to Lost Lake. Come back. Yeah, Ricky, what's up? Ricky, Boozer, can you hear me? Deacon to Lost Lake camp. Okay, this pretty much looks like a marsh. Let's go look. I hate that one. They just freaking. I hate when it takes off the dialogue, man. All right, here we go. We got to be careful. This is deadly as shit here. Hemlock, yeah. Well, here's some. And here's some more. More hemlock, more hemlock. Need more hemlock. Oh, we got to be extra careful. Are we not oh, supposed God to touch it. that she water? Was right. Criers. Oh, damn defected crows. Never gonna leave me alone if I don't burn out their nests. Oh, I don't really see them. I don't see them. I see some over there on the right, but I think we're good right here. I may not even need to burn their nest. No need to disrupt their peace. I need more. Okay, there they go. I hear the music. Okay, just a few more. I gotta find more. Come on, we we'll get the hell out of here already, Deke. Just one more. <sighs> that should do it. See, we didn't even have to freaking do anything. We didn't have to burn no damn nest and wait, waste our Molotovs. That's for silly kids. Oh, yeah. So look at my. Oh, yeah. Oof. Look at my Tommy gun, bro. Well, I'm excited. Damn screamer. Let's get the hell out of here now, guys. Let's do this. Oh, God. Freaks and marauders. Yeah, yeah. Kill each other. Kill each other because I'm not. This is Ricky to Lost Lake. Come back. Yeah, Ricky, what's up? Ricky, Boozer, can you hear me? Think of a Lost Lake camp. Come back. Just uh, checking in to see what else Addie needed. She. Damn it, Ricky. I don't know. Well, Iron Mike said. Boozman, Ricky. Well, uh, give him hell, Boozman. Yeah. I guess they can't hear us because we're too far, maybe. I don't know, but then that wouldn't make sense. Cause how do we hear them? I guess it's one of those, one of those things, just to build up suspense in the game. I don't know. There we go. All right. Let's keep 
keep it going. Any freaks come around here? I'm gonna smoke them. Put some more gas. Just because it's free. And if it's for free, it's for me. I want to upgrade my bike so damn bad, but I can't. Good. Get the hell out of here. Almost there, guys. Almost there. For as far as like upgrading my bike, I'm sure something dumb that I'm like not even, you know, like catching on. Oh, Brian. Okay, where the hell have you been? Brian out. Oh, snap. Now we have another man. Brian, oh. Jesus. Damn it. Alright, so we'll go meet O'Brien after this. This is getting good. We're gonna escape this freaking camp, man. This is gonna be wild. I definitely want to upgrade my bike beforehand. Hopefully they, they, they allow us to go inside to where Sarah is because he's, you heard what this guy had to say. We're not allowed in there without his permission or unless we're in some sort of like job or whatever, which we are, but you know, these guys are assholes. Because every time he just throws himself. It's like, man, I'm not gonna run you over. Come on, Don't be that silly. I'm excited, man. I'm, I'm, I'm excited to see what happens. Now. Giddy up. Giddy up, partner. Well, would you like to taste it? Go right ahead. Thank you, Corporal. I hope you were careful. This is very toxic. Yeah, yeah, sure thing, ma'am. Uh, listen, I got a plan. I don't have time to explain, but the next time I get here, get ready to get the hell out of here, okay? Corporal. I didn't thank you this time. As you were. giving up Ooh. the ability to craft a po poison poison bow so I've come to this camp um, to pretty much upgrade my bike because okay. I read online that hey, Sarge, I was, I was going up? crazy you I read online I am Lumi Ikeda Deacon Deacon Saint Goodbye, Corporal. I read online Good that time. this is where you upgrade your Bye, bike Sarge. so Howdy there Corporal here we go. This is probably where I saw it and hey, I just Sergeant. didn't freaking remember. We got some new uh, paint jobs. I remember we have uh, someone that I used to know. Look how sexy that is. We have this one. How the hell did we survive? You know, let's go yellow. All right. All right. So we'll do the gas tank here. Uh, yes, sir. That, that That's a good one. Oh, we'll add some more suspension. Here we go. Good, good, good choice. Got to say. Now Hold we're going to go to you. the first mission. There's two missions we want to do. One for the captain, which is a bounty hunt. And then we're going to go see O'Brien. That's what we're going to go do. We have a brand new gas tank, so this should last us probably for both missions, hopefully. So, Infected wolves! Ah. Doesn't matter, Deke, man. We got a freaking shoddy. Let's go. Freaking close. Here we go. Word of caution. Captain Curry tells me he was one of our best riders. If you let him get away, you won't be able to catch him. Now 
Oh, that's to see about great. that. St. John out. That's just great. That is just great. This right, is it. I'm gonna get the bike as close as I possibly can. Here we go. All right, where? I don't know, let me get some equipment first. You never know. Here we go. You're mine now. Colonel, I've spotted him. Make this easy on me, are you? No! Bitch! No! 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 no. You need to go, go shoot the tires! My bike! Come on, man. Come on, Deke. Play games. I love it. How you doing, buddy? Huh? Looks like you're having a chaotic day. Yeah, just the way you like it. Oh, you won't take me alive. Well, I think I already did. Uh, don't matter much to me one way or the other. God damn the anarchist. <laughs> All right. Colonel. So that's the balance of the colonel. I'm transmitting the coordinates now. Good work, Corporal. Wait! Wait, you can't leave me! You're welcome. The freaks! The freaks! All right, so now Stop. we're going to go to O'Brien. And we're actually right here. I'm so this Please. should be interesting. See you later, loser. Good luck with the freaks. Or even worse, with the militia camp. <laughs> They're gonna murder you, man. Alright, here we go. Oh, come on, guys. Let's be civil. I'm trying to do a mission here. So, uh, what do you want from me, O'Brien? I'm glad she's alive, your wife. Okay, what, what do you want? I told you the infected, the freaks are mutating. Some faster than others. Uh -huh. We placed a tracking bracelet on one of them so that we could track it and stop it periodically and draw blood samples and check the progress of the virus. Okay, so why do you need me? Well, it's wandered into militia territory. Oh, right. We can't get close to it. Yeah, no fly zone, outpost with RPGs. Exactly. What's this? Once you've tracked it down, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. This pack holds everything you need to do a field biopsy. We need blood and tissue samples. Can you handle that? Yeah, I can figure it out. What? By the way, nice uniform, Corporal. Suits you. Suck it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, snap. O'Brien always the crazy missions. The tracking signal is coming from somewhere around Mount Scott. There's a cave. The subject you're tracking has a super elevated metabolism. We think it might be headed there. There's something else we'd like you to check. We did send a team in on foot. They never came back. Oh my Just God. let me know if you find them. We got people here looking for some closure. So uh, what else can you tell me about this freak you're tracking? We don't have all the answers. All we know is that the infected are mutating. We're talking about leaping past millions of years of evolution. Oh my we god. Think they're communicating with each other the way ants and bees and, and other. You know, to me, sounds like a whole lot of mumbo jumbo. Believe what you want. Once you see our test subject, you'll change your mind. O'Brien out. Oh god. No, I was. Why are these people, like, always wearing suits? Is the virus, like, in the air? 
because I remember that's like what the walking dead is like everybody's initially infected I don't know just a thought kind of weird thankfully I got this new Tommy gun <laughs> and I ain't scared of nothing I think hold on let me get some scrabbity scraps in this house <laughs> Just goods, whatever the hell I need. Okay, it had nothing. Never mind, now I'm pissed. There we go. Oh, God. Brian, I'm at the cave and I'm heading in. You guys gonna be ready? Yes, we're standing by. Oh, Jesus. What's wrong? Eh, freaker shit. Freaker shit everywhere. Hey, O'Brien, uh, you got any idea what took out your men? Am I walking into a horde here? No idea. We never heard back from them. Remember, if you find them, we got people here who'd be grateful. Grateful? Grateful, yeah, that changes everything. Yeah, I got it. Good. I'll take care of it out. I don't want to go against another horde, man. O'Brien, how many men are in here? Uh, how many did you, did you lose? Four. Four men. A researcher and three soldiers. Jesus, O'Brien, what am I doing in here? The researcher, Coop, is a personal friend of mine. You do this and I'll do whatever I can to help you get your wife, O'Brien, out. Brian, so while I'm tracking down your pet freak, give me some more mumbo jumbo. Uh, tell me about the virus. I mean, something that I don't know. For those exposed, the virus infection rate is close to 100%. In the first weeks, almost everyone under the age of 12 was killed. Something to do with how puberty or the lack of it affected the body's immune response. Everyone over the age of 60 mostly were also killed. Their bodies just couldn't handle rapid genetic mutations on a cellular level. Everyone else who is exposed becomes transformed as the genes mutate. The thing is, the virus is mutating at an exponential rate. I know you keep saying that. What does that mean? It means that the infected subject, the freaker you're tracking down, isn't like any you've seen before. Oh, We've God. tracked and identified over 12 mutations. 12? Yeah. And that's just the beginning. You wouldn't believe some of the shit we've seen. Yeah, well, probably would. Say John out. Guys in yellow spacesuits. Oh god. Can't be too hard to find them if they're in here. Not entering. <laughs> No, this is this is scary, dude. No, we gotta go back to where we're researching or looking for clues over here. It's right here. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I was You're literally going past it. Man. Must have huh? come this way. God. Yeah, maybe this way. I got my Tommy gun. I'm okay. <sighs> I think. Oh shit. I don't like this, man. What the frick is going on in this cave? So these are like flares that people left behind. They're giving me a med kit right here. Brian, I found another one of your men. ID says his name was H.S. Patterson. Dead. His radio 
radio's been dead for 12 hours. All their radios have been dead for 12 hours. I don't need to ask. Thank you for doing this. O'Brien out. Okay, now what? Down here? Aw, oh, for great sake. Wait, did I jump too high? I just freaking got injured. What the hell? Oh my god, we're gonna have to go in there. Down there, maybe. That's creepy. Oh shit. Oh shit. Here we go, boys. That thing has like scales or hairs. O'Brien, I uh, found him. ID says his name was Robinson. Okay. Next, I'll let his family know. So, you guys have uh, families. Managed to get them all out while shit was going down? So I'm not gonna apologize for being lucky or luckier than most. Yes, some of us got our families out. Not many, but some. That's just, it's so great. Go, oh, Brian. Good for you. Yeah, we didn't ask for this. Yeah. Neither did anyone else. Oh, God. There's one. All right. Footprints lead over here. Seems like a big freaking nest on that. What the hell is that, dude? Jesus Christ. Let's go to the ice and lava cave. Yeah, this has to be the way. Alright. There's another one. Out right that way. Jesus Christ. Here we go, boys. It's getting a little scary. <laughs> Here it is. Let me get the bandages first. You never know. See how it's got like freaking O'Brien. I uh, reached your guy and uh, yeah, he's dead. ID says G Hernandez. How did it happen? Well, I'm not a coroner, O'Brien. How the hell do I know? Something tore him apart. Uh, this freak I'm tracking. Is there something you haven't told me? Not that I'm aware of. O'Brien out. There's the last one. Cooper, are you there? Is anyone there? Nero Team Bravo, come in. This is Commander James O'Brien. Respond. If you're receiving this transmission, Coop, answer me. Nero, radio. This way. Last piece of the puzzle. Here we go. Must be Cooper. What the hell are you doing down here, man? What the hell is that thing, dude? Looks freaking weird. <gasps> oh, there's a lot yeah, of stuff here. That doesn't look good. Oh, shit. What the hell happened? Oh my god. This does not look good. Okay. Just saying. Look at all the shit they're giving us. Cooper, Cooper. Hey, 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 right here, right here. We're gonna get you out of here, right now. Cooper! Cooper, come in! Sorry, shoot! Move up! He's down! Come on. Oh, Jesus. What's going on, Deacon? Cooper! His legs are broken. 
Hold on, stay with him. I'm sending in another team. No! No, no! <laughs> My... He's compromised. I'm not gonna make it. Let me talk to Jen. Get Jen in here, now! Cooper, what the hell did this to you? What happened? I moved so fast. I just didn't see it coming. You told me that a freak did all of this. Reacher. Reacher. Cooper! Cooper, are you there? Jen? I'm here. I can't hear you. I can't believe it. I thought I'd never hear you more. We're gonna get you out of here. Do you hear me? Go! 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 So what the hell am I dealing with here, O'Brien? The guys at the lab. Reacher. What is it? It's got long arms. No, it's just fast. We've clocked it moving 40 miles an hour. 40? Jesus. And yeah, it's strong. Maybe you should abort. I don't know. Hell with that. I'm not aborting anything. Prepared for this battle. Yeah, it's strong as shit too. Oh, bitch. The reacher should have a tracking device taken. To take it, we can use it to guide you out. What? How? How, O'Brien? We have infrared. We can track the horde's movements. Take it. <sighs> Yo, that shit was fast, dude. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> what? <sighs> Oh. oh, I hope this was worth it, O'Brien. O'Brien, I got your samples. Hey, John, get out of there. What? Get out of there now! There's a horde coming! You've got to be kidding me! Shit, they're getting close. Yeah, it's time to finish these guys off. That's what we need in this. Wait, what? You. Got in this Tommy gun in a better way. Holy shit. 
Jesus, O'Brien. You made it out. Yeah, I made it out, no thanks to you. Transmitting coordinates. O'Brien out. O'Brien. Four men died from this shit. Hope it was worth it. Jesus, listen to you. Those are my men. I don't need you or anyone else telling me. Fly around in your helo well above the shit. You crawl back into what? Cozy underground bunker, or whatever the fuck. You have no idea what it's like out here. I don't have to what it shit. Survive. Oh, you know those men, Cooper. The others, they had no idea what they were walking into, but you did, didn't you? Huh? Didn't you? Radio me when you and your old lady are ready to be lifted out. Maybe this time you'll get on the chopper with her. Oh. Boom, roasted. <laughs> He's not big on tunes. Check in with Weaver. Guys. Colonel, reporting in. Did the uh, good. patrol get the prisoner? Corporal, I'm afraid not. When they went to retrieve him, he was dead. What? Dead? Poison. He killed himself. We're not sure how. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. Don't be. Whatever knowledge he had about us, died with him. Yes, sir. St. John out. Oh, shit. Look at the drum magazine. All right, guys. We're going to end it here. Thank you so much for watching. We are so close to the end. I can feel it. I'm so excited. This game has gotten so good, and this was a great mission. If you enjoyed it, one the other one up ASAP. As always, all you got to do is leave a like, and I'll catch you in the next one.